Hello. So if you're someone who unlocks your FPS by editing the localstorage.db file, you'll notice that as of version 2.2, .2, every time you relaunch the game, it actually automatically caps your FPS again, which is really annoying. So I'll just show you a quick fix to that. Uh, you can see I'm running around in game and I'm capped to 60 FPS, just to show you that I am capped. So we'll close the game. And the first part is the same as you always do. You just go to your Weathering Waves folder, game, uh, client, saved, local storage, and then you're gonna open it in uh, the local storage file in DB browser. Go to browse data, and you go to custom frame rate and just set it to 120. And just make sure you save it. So it's saved, and now the important part that's different for 2.2, uh, go up back to local storage and you have to change the file permissions. So you go to properties, go to the security tab, edit, and then you see I'm clicked on authenticated users right now. Go down here and where it says right, uh, check the deny box. Buy it. Uh, just giving you a warning. It's fine. Just say yes, and then okay. Um, at the end of this, if that doesn't work for you, just uh, go down the list and just do deny on the right for all of these. But for me, it works if I just do it on authenticated users. So that's literally all there is to do the fix. Um, and the rest of the video is just I'm gonna relaunch the game twice just to show you that it actually works. You see in game now, uh, at the very least, the first time we launch it, uh, we're uncapped, I'm above 60 FPS. Uh, but the real test is if I close the game and I relaunch it again, if it'll, if the settings will stick, that's what we're interested in. And see, after I open the game a second time, yeah, it looks like the settings stick. So, yeah, that works for keeping your FPS unlocked without having to change it every time. So, yeah, I uh, hope it works for everyone. See you later.